Robert. Robert. Next question. Uh, I might just have to go for the second best and take the Edward that was just here, but um, I just want to say this question is for Rob, and my name is Nanette, and I am in love with your music and your style, um, and I just wanted to say, would you ever be interested in doing open mic nights ever again, um, even with the fame? Uh, um, yeah, I mean... I would. I'm just too. I, I'm kind of uh, you know, pussy, I guess. <laughs> no, you're not. <laughs> that's the that's the problem. But uh, yeah, no, I'd love to. I mean, I, I think, I think, I think everybody should do open mics. I think it's a very healthy thing for, for, for your soul. So yeah, I'd love to do it again. But uh, I don't know. It's, it's kind of like I'm cutting a record if I do open mic now. So. So don't record a song. <laughs> what? <laughs> Next question. <laughs> Hello, my name is Cindy from Twilight is Anonymous podcast, and I have a question. Have any of you guys seen the New Moon um, trailer fan reaction videos? If you have seen them, what do you think, and are you afraid? <laughs> uh. We, uh, I and everybody in the editing room uh, and the people working on visual effects have seen the fan reaction videos and we could not be more pleased and tickled <laughs> by them. Um, some of them are very intense in their reactions. <laughs> uh, and I wouldn't want to get them mad at me by getting anything wrong <laughs> in the movie. But uh, to be honest, Really, actually, the editor, Peter Lambert, and I were talking about how we should do a fan reaction video to the fan reaction video, because uh, it's, it's just incredibly amusing and inspiring in these um, very uh, dark and long days uh, when we work at the, the, the rather tedious job of, of putting together the little bits of film. Uh, we love them. Cool beans. Next question, please. Hi, my name's Denise, and I'm a huge fan of the saga and the, and the movie. And I was just wondering, my questions for everyone, um, how, has, how has it been different to film in Vancouver as opposed to Portland, and how has the, the, fan, um, the fan response to it um, been different from the first filming? <laughs> Why don't we start on the end? How's that? <laughs> okay. Um, I guess. Um, it's, I mean, I think Portland's a lot more. Portland has a, a lot more of an edge to it. Um, just to start with, but I think the difference. I mean, for me, anyways, is that the second one, um, there's definitely a, a, a bigger following. There's a lot more people who are aware of who we are, um, and so there's a huge difference in the fact that there's just a, a ton of fans versus there's a couple here and there in Portland. But both places are cold and wet. <laughs> They're beautiful, don't get me wrong, but it's just not fun not wearing any clothes there. <laughs> Alright, so next question. Thank you. You know, Chris, while we're reading, I'm going to ask you, what did you find to be the biggest challenge? Uh, was there a scene or moment or technical aspect that was the biggest challenge in this film? Uh, there, there are a lot of challenges to this film um, because of because of the werewolves, because of the trip to Italy. There are a lot of logistical challenges, which are rather boring, so I won't even enumerate them. Just I'll just say that the wolves are going to be great. Uh, fil um, filming in Italy was a tremendous challenge because everybody knew that we were going to be in Monte Pulciano, and I mean everybody, and uh, uh, everywhere that the camera wasn't pointed, there were hundreds of, um, of fans there, and it wasn't so much that we minded them being there, it was great. As a matter of fact, people applauded after every take, which is unheard of. It was like doing theater or something. Um, <laughs> But uh, but actually, uh, it, was, it was just the sheer logistics of, of getting through uh, all the fans to get to where we had to stand by the camera 
and there was there was one moment where I, I really had to go to the bathroom, but um, there was not a single cafe that I could walk into where I, I, I wouldn't be mobbed. And, and by the way, this is not because I'm me, it's just because uh, people were interested to see if I could set up a meeting with Rob or with <laughs> another member of the cast. Um, uh, so so that, that was quite difficult, actually, but also kind of intriguing and fun in its own way. Excellent. So I think we have another question, right? Perfect. Hi, I'm Breezy. Uh, Taylor, this is for you. I know you kind of asked me to this, but how was it filming, like, half-naked with the random weather conditions in Vancouver? And also, for fans who want to see it, can you do a backflip for us? 